Hello and thanks for joining. Today's topic is going to be a math tip and I'm going to quickly show you how to uh, work with exponents also known as powers. And I'm going to walk through a couple quick examples. So I wanted to point out that all of these tutorials will eventually be posted on my website which is www.10minutetrain.com and here's some other links uh, that may be helpful. So I pointed out a couple things here. One thing under um, understanding exponents is if you look at the number here so you've got your 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 base number and then you you have an exponent of 2 or 3 to the power of 2 that simply means multiply 3 times 3 2 times likewise 3 to the third 3 times 3 times 3 or a couple quick rules are that uh, 10 to the power of any number here is equal to 1 plus x number of zeros. So 10 to the fifth is 1 and then 5 zeros. 10 to the seventh is 1 plus 7 zeros. And then anything to the power of 0 is equal to 1. So I'm going to walk through just a couple quick examples here just to make sure you get it. And so I'm going to do, let's do 4 with an exponent of 3. So 4 to the power of 3. So that's going to be equal 4 times 4 times 4. Okay, in this case, so that's 4 times 4 is 16. 16 times 4 is equal to 64. Okay, I'll do 5. Let's do 5 to the power of 4. Four, so that's going to be equal to 5 times 5 times 5 times 5. Okay, so that's going to be equal to 5 times 5 is 25. 25 times 5 times 5. So now 25 times 5 is 125. 125 times 5 is going to be equal to, let's see, what is that, 625? 625, I believe. I also want to do a quick example of the um, 10 of the 10 example. So 10 to the fourth is going to be equal to 1 plus this number, the exponent number of 0. So that's going to be 1 and then 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, or 10 to the 2. Or let's do 10 to the third. So that's going to be equal to 1 and then 3 zeros. Okay, and then to, to map that out, 10 to the third would be 10 times 10 times 10. Oh, let me move that up there. Times 10. 10 times 10 is 100, and 100 times 10 is going to be equal to 1,000. So that's how that maps out. That's what I want to share with you. Thanks for joining. Take care.